Hi there, in this video I will show you how to set up your brand new UFI E220. Let's get started. Firstly, make sure that it is plugged in and also it is powered on. After this, you would need to download this UFI security app and then open it and either log in or sign up if you didn't have an account earlier before. So, just enter your email and password and proceed to the next step. Let me just enter my password and get back to you. So, at this point we need to add the device. Tap this button, then choose this wired camera section and after this you would need to choose this indoor cam pan and tilt 2K. Then choose a location, you can set office like I did or you can tap this add new home button and just enter manually. Then as a next step, just plug the device into the outlet before mounting and proceed with the setup. Wait until the LED turns solid blue. Mine is solid blue right now, so let's go to the next step. Now we need to scan the QR code which is placed at the bottom of the camera. Just point the camera in it and wait a couple of seconds. So now we just need to enter the setup mode. For this, we would need to turn around the camera and find this setup button. Just press and hold it for about 2 seconds till you hear a beep. Great! Now you just need to confirm it by tapping this heard a beep and wait till it will be connecting. So now we just need to select the Wi-Fi network. I'm gonna select mine and type in the password. After this press the turn button Connecting then the confirm. And wait a couple of seconds till it will be connecting to the Wi-Fi network as you heard. And now the camera was added successfully and all is left is to tap this next button and to choose the device's name. For example, you can choose living room or you can customize it and just name it by your name like this. Then tap the confirm button and let's move on to the next step. Here we can manage content extension of notifications, but you can do it later in the settings, so let's go to the next step. Now, before the first use, we would need to format micro SD card, so let's do it now. And after this, just select where your camera will be placed. I'm gonna select table. And we are all set, we just need to tap this finish button and now you can see the live footage right here. And that was all for now. Hope this video was useful for you and thank you so much for watching.